Hello, I'm David Pogue. Now, usually in these tech videos, I review gadgets. I might put on a silly costume or do a goofy little skit, anything for a little entertainment value. This week, however, I offer you a rant about laptop battery measurements, of all things. See, we all know that when you shop for a laptop, the ads are grossly inflated. It might say, up to five hours. But of doing what? Measured how? Says who? And what about that phrase, up to? Is there a bigger cop-out in the English language? Look, this laptop gets up to 1,000 hours of charge. Up to just means some number below this one. Look, in every other product category, there are standard, simple, easy to understand measurements, right? Cell phone, you have talk time and you've got standby time. Cars, right? You have miles per gallon city and miles per gallon highway. iPod, hours of music playback, hours of video playback. Why can't there be a simple standard measurement for laptops? This is the question being posed by chip maker AMD in a very strange and yet somehow compelling PR campaign lately. See, it turns out that there actually is a standard laptop battery measurement, and it's called Mobile Mark. And it was developed by Intel and a bunch of other computer makers. Talk about the fox designing the hen house. Anyway, the problem with Mobile Mark is it doesn't represent real world conditions. For example, they start by turning the screen down to 60 nits. That's about like that, okay? Thanks. They also do the test by turning off battery using features like Wi-Fi and Bluetooth. Not very realistic. And in fact, there are three different Mobile Mark tests. In one of them, you just play a DVD movie over and over until the battery's dead. In the second one, they do productivity tasks, Microsoft Office, email, Photoshop. The third one is just reading a PDF document, turning the page once every two minutes. And by the way, when you see the numbers of battery hours in the ads, you don't know which of those three tests they're talking about. So, what AMD is proposing is something like this. Very simple, active time, resting time, right? It's just like the cell phones with the talk time and the standby or the cars with the highway and the city mileage, right? Best case, worst case. Why can't every store and every computer manufacturer use a realistic test and an easy to understand report like that? Well, surprise, surprise, AMD is running into plenty of resistance from, for example, the big box retailers. They would much rather inflate the battery estimates and get more money out of you. Well, you know what? Shame on them. It's time for the computer industry to start speaking the truth. And I think my final slide is going to really make the point that I'm trying... Oh, no.